beautiful singing. I thought today we could do the very hungry caterpillar. I'll move a little bit closer so you can see the pictures. In the light of the moon, a little egg lay on the leaf. Oopsie. One Sunday morning, the warm sun came up. Pop! Out of the egg came a very tiny, hungry caterpillar. You see Mr. Sunshine? He started to look for some food. He was very hungry. So on Monday, he ate through one apple, but he was still hungry. On Tuesday, he ate through two pears, but he was still hungry. On Wednesday, he ate through one, two, three plums, but he was still hungry. On Thursday, he ate through four strawberries, but he was still hungry. On Friday, he ate through five oranges, one, two, three, four, five. That's a lot of oranges. He was still hungry. <gasps> On Saturday, he ate through one piece of chocolate cake, one ice cream, one pickle, one slice of Swiss cheese, one slice of salami, one lollipop, one piece of mm -mm -mm cherry pie, one sausage, one cupcake, and one slice of watermelon. Oh, that night he had a stomach ache. The next day was Sunday again, so the caterpillar ate through one nice green leaf, and after that he felt much better. <gasps> What happened to him? Did he get a little bit bigger? No, he wasn't hungry anymore. And he wasn't a little caterpillar anymore. He was a big fat caterpillar. He built a small house called a cocoon around himself. He stayed inside for more than two weeks. Kind of what we've been like. Then he nibbled a hole in the cocoon, pushed his way through, and <gasps> he was a beautiful butterfly. Oh, the end. That was a good story. Thank you guys for listening. Enjoy your weekend. I miss you. I hope to see you soon. Bye.